For the trillionaires, man, what it do with y'all? Welcome back to another video out in there, bit. You know what I'm saying? I want to talk to y'all about something today, man. This is going to be a serious video. Try to make it as serious and entertaining as I possibly can. You know what I'm saying? Because that's what I do. You know, but, um, and I made a video, I made a video about this already on my word of trillionaires, something similar to this, man. Um, so I don't know, man. Maybe I might put this on word of visionaries. I don't know, man, but um, the title of this video is going to be called Two Options in Life. Now, let me explain. You see, I know you have heard the term 99%. And I know you have heard the term 1%. What the 99% means is individuals they are living a average, mediocre, nine times out of 10, they hate their life as type of life. I'm telling you what it is. And the 1% are the individuals that are rich. They are living a life of um, freedom. They are living a life of um, abundance. You see, 99% of the human population have all fallen to the trap. And the trap that we have fallen into is you fell into the trap of being broke. And what happens when you are broke is that you are automatically a loser by default. And, you know, you probably have been born into a losing circumstance. You see... That's what the 99% is. And on top of that, you will be taught how to live like a loser and be a loser. Think like a loser. Feel like a loser. <laughs> I'm, I'm just, I'm, motherfucker, you're just a flat out loser. And I fell into the trap as well. Don't think, don't think I'll, don't think I would just, oh, this, this, you know, because I'm telling you, I, I really do think people think I'm arrogant. <laughs> and guess what? I want you to think like that. Because you so look, man. In order for you to be successful out in here, man, you gotta, man, you gotta look at yourself like you are the greatest thing to ever walk on the face of this earth, and that's exactly what it is that I do. So keep on, so go ahead, keep on looking at yourself like you are pitiful, <laughs> and that's why you're living a pitiful life now. But that ain't what I wanted to talk about. There's two options in life, my G. And the two options in life is either you be a winner in life or either you be a loser in life. Now, like I just said, 99% of the population are losers. And like I just said as well, I know how it feels to be a loser. I'm telling you what it is, man. Jacking off every single day, complaining about my dating life, complaining about my finances, um, having, having bad relationships, or, you know, relationships turned out negative. What's some other shit? <laughs> uh, unhealthy. There's plenty more things I can't think of at the current moment, but those are all forms of losing, my G. When you're winning, right? When you're winning, how do you think your life will go when you are winning? Because I know how it feels to win, my G. Oh, trust, I know for a fact I know how it feels to win. When you're winning, let me tell let me tell you some things that happens when you're winning. When you're winning, all of a sudden, all of a sudden you you can have all of a sudden when you're winning, you know, money just comes to you. So you're gonna be rich by default. When you're winning, all of a sudden now, now all the partners it is that you always wanted, now they want you when you're winning. When you're winning, all of a sudden, now your relationships start to be all positive, all lovey-dovey and shit. Like you hit the lottery. Now everybody want to start acting all, congratulations. When you're winning, right? When you're winning, now you can be disciplined. Now you can, now you can do what it is that you want to do. When you're winning, you can buy the things it is that you want. Look at all the things it is that you could do when you're winning. But yet, when you're losing, what you are right now, what can you do? I'm tired of being a loser, G. I'm tired of it. <laughs> I'm 
I'm telling you what, I'm tired of being a loser, man. What do you get out of being a loser but being a loser? What do you get? Here, so I know, I know for a fact it's a man right now watching this video. You're probably having struggles trying to get women. Oh, trust me, that's what the 99% is going through. Y'all suck at getting girls. That's some loser shit. And since you're struggling with that, right, what's going to happen is you're going to have to jack off. And that's another losing ass shit that you're going to do. Then on top of that, you're going to be depressed that you're jacking off. Now you're losing times three. And on top of that, when you're when you're jacking off every day, you're not going to have motivation to get rich. Now you're now you're losing time. You suck. Boy, this <laughs> this losing. I'm telling you, man. This this, lo this losing shit, man. It's a, it's a disease out in this bitch. I'm telling you what it is. It creeps up on you in stealth mode. You will have no idea that you're losing in life, my G. You will have none, unless someone tell you that you're losing. <laughs> but nine times out of ten, <laughs> look, man. It's the reason. It's the. It's look, man. This is why rich don't like to give out their information. Because they want to, they want to keep y'all losing, and on top of that, when they keep y'all losing, you don't, they don't have no competition. So let me talk about that right quick. Here you go. Your life just suck. You just day, day, day in and day out, you jacking off every single day, complaining about your dating life. Oh, I can't get no girls. I, I can't get the girls I want. I can't get girls. I'm broke. I'm broke. Uh, I'm depressed. I'm depressed. They want you to be like that. And since you're like that, right? <laughs> since you like that, right? Here you go. You thinking you're going to feel some sympathy, right? You thinking you're going to feel some sympathy when in reality, these people is laughing at you because you suck in life. I, I, I can't get the partners I want. That's what they want you to do. Oh, I'm broke. I'm broke. That's what they want you to be. Uh, I'm depressed. I'm, that's what they want. And you're living up to their expectations, G. Or to a female watching this um, video, madam. I'm telling you what it is. But real talk, though. I'm going to say this one more time, my G. One thing, <laughs> one thing about losing, man. One thing about losing, it is very easy to lose. <laughs> I'll tell you what it is, man. It's, it's very easy to lose. It's, it's very easy, man. It, it, it is honestly very easy to just fall off. It's 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 kind of it's kind of it's kind of effed up to be honest with you. I'll tell you, man, get high up on the days of no fat, right? Get high up on the days of no fat, and then watch your urges, watch your urges start urging you, telling you to go back to your old ways, and watch how easy it is to gravitate to going back to your old ways. And look at how funny it is. It's so easy to fall off, right? Or it's so easy to lose, right? But yet, it's so hard to, it's so hard to win. <laughs> but we were set up to lose up in this bitch, but I ain't gonna sit back and cap. I'm talking about the spiritual development. Man, they know, they know what they was doing, man. They want to make your ass a fucking failure. And I'll be damned. And I'm gonna say this one more time. 99% of the population, and to be honest with you, my G, I'm not just talking about humans at this point. 99% of the whole entire population on this earth are fucking losers. For the humans, you're jacking off every single day, complaining about your dating life. You just, you know, what's some other things, man? You broke. You just suck. Negative thinking and all type of shit. And look, man, I ain't trying to get too deep out in this bitch, but look at, look, look, man. Look at all the motherfucking bugs and shit like that. Look at all the animals. These motherfuckers just living in the wild. Look at, look, look, look. Motherfuckers living in the wild and shit like that. They got to think about survival, my G. Their life is at risk day to every single day. I'd be damn personally on some shit. I'm telling you what it is. But, but, point I'm trying to get across though, man. Point I'm trying to get across is you got two options in life, my G. You got two options in life. One, you either be a winner or two, you either be a loser. Now, like I just said, 99% of the population are losers. So there's a 99.9% .9 chance that you are, you watching what you watching this video right now, you are a loser and you know what it is that I'm talking about. Look at how your life is. 
there's a 9.9 .9 times out of 10 chance that you do not like your life. <laughs> I'm telling you what it is. And when you're losing, that's how it's supposed to be. Real talk. So all it is I'm trying to say is if you're losing right now, then why are you continuing to keep on losing, my G? <laughs> why are you keep on continuing to losing if you know that you that you hate your life, my G? Why are you keep on continuing to losing? Why? Why not trans why 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 not transform to be a winner, my G? Why not start winning out in this vision? Ain't you tired of losing? <laughs> I'll be man, I'll be sick and tired of I got I gotta I gotta keep on going through everyday life just me being a fucking loser. I'll be tired of that shit. Every single day you just wake up and be a loser. <laughs> man, I swear, G. I'm telling you, man, like I said, I know how it feels to be a loser, my G. I know how it feels. It sucks. You get what do you get out of being a tell me what do you get out of being a loser, my G? What do you get? What do you get out of being a loser? What do you get? Because as I recall, when you're a loser, you, you can't get the girls you want if you're a man or if you're a female. You can't get the dudes you want. When you're a loser, you're broke, <laughs> borderline homeless or some shit. When, when you're a loser, right, you, you think depression, you know what I'm saying? You're just a negative ass spirit. <laughs> when you're a loser, right, when you're a loser, your relationships start to suck. What did you get out of... What did you get out of being a loser, my G? And yet, you continue to still be in that losing ass situation. Motherfucker, I got tired of that shit. <laughs> I'm telling you what it is, man. Real talk, man. I got tired of being a damn loser. I said, fuck that shit. I want to be a winner. <laughs> because you you will always get something when you're winning, though. You will always get something out of winning, though. Real talk. All of, when you're winning, now all of a sudden, people like to respect you. People like to congratulate you when you're winning. <coughs> What the fuck? But now all of a sudden though, all of a sudden, now now you can get now you can get money easily. I know I know y'all I know y'all had that happen to y'all before. When when let's say you was in desperate need of a job or some shit like that, right? When when you was losing right, when you was in desperate need of a job, you can never get a job out in this bitch. But now all of a sudden when you got money right, now all of a sudden when, when you when you got the job it is that you always wanted, now all of a sudden you can now now all of a sudden all the other jobs wanna hire you. Now all of a sudden, all the all, all the um now you can get money easily. Now all of a sudden, now your relationships. Oh, I already said that. You know they congratulate you. Now all of a sudden, you can get the partners it is that you want. Now all of a sudden, now all of a sudden, you can be disciplined. <laughs> now all of a sudden, you can do whatever it is that you always truthfully wanted to do this whole entire time. You will always get something from winning, though. You will never get nothing out of losing. But yet we gravitate to being a fucking loser. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, your body was meant for your ass to fail. I'm telling you. I'm telling you what it is, man. I like like I made a I made a video about this yesterday, man. I said, I said, I think we got a fetish for losing, my G. I honestly believe I honestly believe we got a fetish for losing. If it's not that we have a fetish for losing, then it's I think it's simply because we've been losing for a very long time and that's all we know. So, you know, like I said, you know, since birth. Since birth, you have been a loser since birth. Look, man, I always say, if you was born in the middle class and lower class, you lost in life by default. <laughs> I'm telling you what it is. So since birth, right? Since birth, you you was losing. You was losing. And you know, how over, how, however old that you are at this current moment, that's all you know. All you know is how to be a loser. So when you try to be a winner, right? When you try to be a winner, you know what I'm saying? Now you got to work hard to be a winner. So you say, uh, I don't want to work hard. I'd, I'd rather just sit back and complain. That's strike one. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Real talk though, man. You know, you're just going to you're just going to sit back and complain because the work is too hard. You know what I'm saying? You haven't you haven't you haven't been gifted to be a winner. And I'm going to just say it one more time. <laughs> Look, G. I'll try to use this example right quick. Look, man. I'm going to say this, man. I'm going to use a spiritual example, man. I believe in I believe in reincarnation. <laughs> I'm telling you what it is, man. I believe in that. And um, I, I believe that. You know, the way it is that you live at this current moment, like what you're going through right now or like how you live this life form. I believe that, you know, I, because I believe in the law of attraction. So the way it is that you live your life right now, right, is going to be the type of life it is that you're going to receive in your next life or some shit. I'm telling you what it is. Like, I, look, man, I ain't trying to get too deep in this bitch, but all this I'm trying to say, look, G, if you're a person that believes in destiny or if you're a person that believes in like everything was pre-planned, if you if you believe everything is pre-planned, then look in your life and why do you think your life sucks now? <laughs> why are you 
you think you're losing now? If if you are a believer that everything was already pre pre planned, then why do you think you are a loser now? I'm telling you, I'm telling you, look, G. <laughs> why I say G like that? <laughs> but look, man, like I said, if I had a past life, my G, if I had a past life, then you know, if I had a past life, then I think what happened with me was I probably lived a mediocre life. Like I was, I was at the point of living medi mediocrity, and also I was at the point of like you know, so you know, I was, I was, I was at the point of like I'm motivated to get to the top. So therefore, I was born in the middle class. Because the middle class, like lower class, you having some lower ass type of thinkings and you got some, you got the upper class type of motivation. That's why you in the middle class. <laughs> I'll tell you what it is. And so, but, um, but yeah, man. So, and basically I caught on to that. I cut, I caught on. So I'm saying, okay, so, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I believe in, I believe it was pre planned and shit like that. So I said, okay. So if it was like that, right? So what it is that I'm going to do now, right? I'm going to make sure that I get in the highest vibration that I could get. I'm going to make sure that I have every single thing it is that I desire. <laughs> I'm telling you what, I'm going to make sure I got all the, I'm going to make sure I, I'm going to make sure I am extremely rich. I'm going to make sure I got all the women in the world that I want. I'm going to make sure that I'm living a life of royalty, AKA have my mansions that I want, have my supercars that I want. I'm going to make sure that I'm the most positive individual or I can, um, you know, I'm the most happiest. I could be. I'm gonna make sure all of those. Th I'm gonna make also another thing. <laughs> I'm gonna make sure that I am a full blooded winner, and I'm gonna make sure I'm the luckiest spirit alive. Simply because when I vibrate like this, right? When when I'm living the life it is that I want to live, then what's gonna happen is in my next vessel on some shit like that, right? I'm gonna I'm gonna be in that same type of energy space. I'm gonna be in that same type of vibration. So it's like if I'm a winner now, then my next vessel I'm gonna be a winner by default since birth. If I'm the luckiest spirit now, then I'm gonna be the luckiest spirit since birth. If I get all the women now, then I'm gonna have all the women or I'm gonna have all the partners it is that I want since birth. Instead of me, I got I gotta struggle. I gotta be broken, be a loser. I'll be damn if I gotta go through that shit again. And that's what you're going through right now. You was born as a loser simply because what could have happened was you was losing once upon a time. And I caught on to that shit. I said, I'll be damned. <laughs> I'm telling you what it is. But anyways, man. Um, but yeah, man, real talk, man. I, I, so look, man. All it is, I'm saying, man, you got two options in life, my G. Either you could continue to be a loser or you could start to be a winner. Like I said, man, one thing about losing, it's very easy to lose. This is why 99% of the population is the 99%. These motherfuckers would rather sit back, complain, and have bad luck. <laughs> y'all motherfuckers, I'm, look, man, y'all stupid. <laughs> I'm telling you what it is. Hey, look, man, me personally, me, I, like I said, I know how it feels. I'm telling you what it is. Don't think, don't think I was just this, oh, I'm just this arrogant, positive, loving, confident, you know, borderline rich, you know what I'm saying, individual, no, real talk, man, I had a grind, I, motherfucker, I, I, man, it took me years to get to the position that I am now, I'm telling you what it is, I'm telling you, I made a video like a couple of days ago, or a, a week ago, I said I'm 99.9999% to where it is I want to be, motherfucker, my life is complete at this point, I'm telling you what it is, but it wasn't always like this, I know how it feels to, I know how it feels to be a loser, I know how it feels to be broke. I know how it feels to not get girls. I know how it feels to, what's some other things? Jack off every, I know how it feels to do some loser ass shit. Think like a loser, feel like a loser. Act like I know how it feels, bro. And me personally, man, I just got tired of it. <laughs> and Eric Thomas, um, it was like a, it was like a motivational, um, he, it was like a mixtape he made like a back, back in the day. Like it was like a motivational mixtape. And I remember, I'll, I'll never forget what he said. He said, um, he said, um, he said, when you're sick and tired of being sick and tired, that is when you're going to live the life it is that you always wanted to live. And that's facts. You're probably at a point where you're not sick and tired of being sick and tired. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, like, I, I, how do you change that? Look, man, I, I don't know, G. One thing I will say, though, you better you better get sick and tired very quick, because if you don't get sick and tired very quick, then what's going to happen is you're going to waste a whole lot of time. Then you might be in your you might be in your 50s and 60s. Then you're going to look back in your life. You're going to say. Oh, I, I didn't live the way it is I wanted to live. And I'll be damned if I do some shit like that. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm telling Boy, you better catch on to this shit quick, man. I'm telling you, man, one of the biggest things we got is time. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, man, one thing about this life that we are in, one thing about your body, my G, one thing about your body, 
I don't think your body is on your side. <laughs> and look, man, your body wants you to survive and shit like that. But when it comes for you, when it, you know, when it comes for you trying to live the life it is that you want to live or live a life of a winner, your body ain't going to help you for that shit. Your brain and your body is going to tell you all the things that is going to be the exact opposite of a winner. <laughs> your body is going to encourage you to be addicted all day. Your body is going to encourage you to eat unhealthy food. Your body is going to encourage you to think depression. Your body is encouraging you to do the shit. So all this I'm saying, man, my best advice I give to you, man. Hey, look, man, if you want to be a winner, my G, the first thing you got to do, you can no longer listen to your body because your body is going to be your biggest enemy when you want to be a winner. <laughs> I'm telling you what it is, man. Get high up on the days of no fap. You'll see what I'm talking about. Oh, why well, I feel all these urges? Oh, uh, I think I should, I, I should relapse. That's your body telling you that shit. <laughs> I'm telling you what it is, man. Man, your body is a motherfucking ah. I'm telling you what it is. But um, uh, but yeah, man. I think honestly, man. I think I got my point across. I'm gonna get this video up to 2121. Make it even out on an odd number. <laughs> you know. But anyways, man. Um, but yeah, man. Yeah, man, like I said, man, I just got tired of losing, my G. I honestly got tired of losing, bro. So, hey, look, man. <laughs> look, man, if you want to change your life around, my G, then you got to do everything it is that you possibly can do. Uh -huh, that's exactly what the fuck it is that I'm doing or some shit. <laughs> because I'll be damned if I got to live like a motherfucking peasant. You got me all the way fucked up. <laughs> I'm living life like a winner and living in royalty out in this bitch. And on that note, we out.